The airplane is fully capable of doing an automatic landing, automatic braking, bringing the airplane all the way to touchdown, flare, land, and brake. So what we're going to do now today, we're going to practice an auto land and show how is the automatic landing is being done. And below 4,000, that's when it's going to change the landing capability to Cat 3 Dual. That Cat 3 Dual means the airplane is actually capable of doing a landing and zero visibility. However, regulation, because of the fire brigades and emergencies, we're not allowed to land at zero visibility. And the minimum, it depends from company to company, but here in Gulf Air, we're limited to 200 meters. Lock start. And as we see, the airplane is capturing the, the localizer. So now laterally, it's synchronized with the runway. That diamond shows the runway is a little bit to the left, and you see the airplane is correcting it. Speed VS. Final, uh, one to left. So 070, I behind tower, continue approach, one to left. Continue approach, Gulf Air, 070. Battery 1110, we get right on Foxtrot, right on Hotel, Alpha, left on Papa, stand 11. Okay, uh, Foxtrot, Hotel, Alpha, Papa, 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 Now the airplane is getting close to the Vertical profile of the runway. So as we see, the diamond is moving towards the yellow line. Lights of the star. Check. Flaps two. Speed check. Flaps two. Go around. It's 2,500. Go around altitude 2,500. Check. Fly slow. Get down. So now we have autopilot one and two are engaged. Auto throttle, which is basically taking off of the speed. The cat three dual, the landing capability is good for on auto land. We have the airplane captured on the localizer laterally and vertically on the glide slope on the profile of the runway. Flaps three. Speed check flaps three. Flaps full. Speed check flaps full. Landing checklist. Landing checklist. Cabin crew. Advice. Auto thrust. Speed. Auto rake. Is low. Cam middle. Landing one in blue but cabin is secure. Landing checklist completed. Clear to land. By the visual aid, the only pilot he knows about his vertical profile, whether he is aligned with the runway vertically, laterally is easy to judge. However, vertically, if he needs visual, we have something called the pappies, and the pilot should see two reds, two white. That means he is in the profile. If it goes red, he is low, and if it goes white, he is above the profile. 1,000. So if you see the airplane is actually navigating it perfectly by the ILS, the glide slope, and the localizer. And if we look outside, it's exactly the two wise to raise the visual aids that we have. However, the airplane still is in the approach mode. It did not get into the landing mode. All the pilot has to do is monitor the indication and take over if the indication are not corresponding to what is expected to be performed by the airplane in case of the auto land. 500. Check. Stabilize. Good. Continue. Now that glide slope and lock this approach. Land. Land. <coughs> That's indicating now the airplane has gone into the land mode. Indicating on the PFD. And as we see, it's maintaining the center line of the runway and the vertical profile. 100 above. Check. The next thing is thinking about the player on the landing. So now from land mode, minimum player, player, 20, 10, retard, 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 
roll out. Okay. Still the autopilot is engaged. That's an auto land. Spoilers. The airplane is automatically braking. Versus. And maintaining the center line of the runway. Now when the pilot is happy, he can just disconnect the autopilot. And take over the manual braking. Check. 17 knots. Check. Clear left side. Right clear. Check on. Clear left side. Right clear. So as a brief. Antilla 257040, less than 5, from you want to land. So as we all noticed, that airplane is 100% safe when it comes to the automatic landing. And that airplane can land at any weather as far as it is not a thunderstorm, whatever is there is a fog, reduced visibility. There is the pilot's eyes actually is this instrument more than the actual eyes. And the airplane is fully capable of landing and doing auto braking and bringing the airplane to a stop. All the pilot has to be vigilant and monitor the correct modes are engaged of the Autoland. Excellent. Thank you very much. Pleasure.